and a happy Thursday to everyone. We're seeing a refreshing afternoon out there today. Temperature is actually feeling October-like out there for your early afternoon. Currently sitting in those 50s to low 60s out there for your lunchtime hour. 56 right now, currently checking in at Summersville. 59 degrees in Oak Hill, 60 in Pineville. Currently 51 degrees right now as you go across Bluefield. So looking at the rest of your day today, we're talking nothing but sunshine in the forecast going forward. Temperatures warming up into those low to mid 60s out there for your afternoon high. Then we're seeing clearing conditions taking place as you go towards your overnight with those temperatures dropping back into those upper 30s to low 40s out there for your overnight low. Looking at our temperatures out there for the next several days, we're staying close to average out there for the afternoon high today. And if you're a fan of warmer weather, we're talking a spring-like day out there for Friday, mid-70s likely in the forecast. But don't get used to that because that cold front pushes through towards this weekend, dropping those temperatures back into those low 60s Saturday into Sunday, slightly warmer as we go towards the early portions of next week. So looking at our weather headlines out there for the next several days, we're talking sunshine and cooler temperatures out there for your Thursday. We're staying dry with temperatures rebounding into those mid-70s by Friday. Beautiful evening for all the football games taking place. But we are tracking a cold front starting late Friday night to early Saturday. They may try to bring a few stray showers away Saturday morning before turning dry Saturday afternoon. And that dry weather will stick with us as we conclude our upcoming weekend. Really nothing to talk about on the current satellite and radar. We're seeing mostly clear conditions pretty much across the whole eastern half of the country. And that trend is generally going to continue out there for the next several days. So looking at our upcoming rain chances out there for the next seven days, we're expecting mostly dry weather for at least the next six to seven days. The only exception comes early Saturday morning with that cold front I was talking about that could produce a few light showers early Saturday morning. But that's pretty much the extent of it because as we get closer towards the second half of this weekend into much of next week, we're turning mostly dry and even warmer just in time for Halloween taking place as you go towards the latter half of next week. Temperatures potentially in those 70s. So looking at our football forecast out there for Friday, if you're planning on going to any of those football games taking place, temperatures starting off in those upper 60s out there for kickoff, warming up into those upper 50s out there for halftime. So overall, a mild night ahead under partly cloudy skies. So as we take a look at our 6 to 10 day temperature outlook, there are signs as we go towards the second half of this month into early November, uh, or I should say as we close out this month into early November, temperatures are much warmer than average across much of the eastern and central half of the country, much cooler as you go across the western half of the country. So looking at our seven day forecast, really not seeing signs of any rain in the forecast, only exception is Saturday morning where we could see a brief shower or two other than that. Seeing a dry stretch of weather, 60s in the forecast today, 70s likely tomorrow. Expecting a cooler but beautiful end to the weekend. And that dry weather is sticking with us Monday, Tuesday, into Wednesday of next week. With temperatures warming up to a more spring-like level once again as we go towards the middle and end of next week.